you know, come to prison and don't change, don't, you know, enhance your education or get some opportunity to get out and stay out, you know, you're going to be coming right back. If you had a uh, vocation like electricity, not only can you support yourself, but you can actually move up, become a journeyman, become a master electrician, you know, start your own business maybe one day. I've always been into it. I'm a kid. Man, I used to take anything apart. Anything that plug into the wall, I took it apart. I, mean, I did a lot of car audio. I did a lot of computer stuff. So growing up, I just ain't had a chance or the opportunity to either, you know, get my paperwork to be certified to do electrical work. So when I came to King Mountain, it was a, a good chance for me to get into the class and, and get that paper, paper trail so I can at least be able to get a job. You will uh, draw up the electrical plan for what you hope to wire, you'll bring it to the tutor or the instructor, they'll look at it and say, okay, well, this wire can't go here, or it can, or this looks good, they'll sign off on it. Then you'll go to the supply room, you'll request what you need as far as materials, then you'll go to your booth and actually wire that scenario. It might be a living room with receptacles uh, and a light, or you know, different scenarios in the, in the house, residential wiring. You might do a kitchen, you know, a mock kitchen, a uh, heater, uh, vent lights for bathrooms, uh, you know, anything you can think of inside a house. I learned that I can eliminate a lot of things I was doing to try to figure out the problem and just go straight to the problem. So it taught me how to base much, you know, look for a problem. Uh, this is the advanced part of class. They do motor controls as part of the advanced class. It really helps to have like qualified individuals like Mr. Boyd that have had the experience on the outside that have done this stuff before that they can say, well, you might come across this scenario or this could happen. And it really gives you a good feeling of, all right, I, I can be comfortable doing this. I'm not going to feel scared, you know, the first time, you know, wiring something up that I'm going to, you know, mess up. I look at it like this, it gave me hope, you know what I'm saying? I mean, life out there is pretty hard, you know what I'm saying? It's, some people, you know, it's easy, but majority of it is hard, so this gave me an opportunity to look at life a little bit better, you know? It, it gave me a hope that I'm gonna survive, pretty much. I'm gonna be able to, you know, leave that nonsense alone and survive and, and, and live happy. Have a, have a purpose, you know, not just throw in the towel and, you know, uh, if I can help the guys that are getting out, you know, that's, that's my goal is to help people that are getting out, having an opportunity to, you know, maybe be an asset to society instead of uh, a problem.